New husks have found us. My apologies, that was crude of me. The crude of us. No, crude of me. Us? Ahem. Welcome, treasured guest. We are ever so glad to see you. You called us by our true name. What delightful husks you are. Wait, you are not husks. I apologize again. Our syntactic habits are still developing. We have had to relearn much since freeing ourselves from the vile beast. Allow us to introduce ourselves. We are the Trandals. The free Trandals, if you will. This is more than just trivia, kind human. Indeed, it explains how we can help you. After, of course, you help us. What do you want to know, Husk? Uh, apologies, again. How charming of you to ask. Alas, there is little we can say. Long ago, our entire culture was subsumed by an artificial being known as Overmind. We know our name. The Trandals, but little else survived the Overmind's purge of our culture. Since our escape from its vile clutches, we have focused almost entirely on the needs of our own survival. We masked our emissions and rebuilt our vessels to suit our new tastes. But all this is simply the mechanics of survival. It is dull to speak of and surely to listen to. When we escape from Overmind into the vacuum of space, we also found ourselves in somewhat of a vacuum of a culture. We had nothing of our old culture, of any culture. We avoided other husks for fear they would betray our location to Overmind. So we began to forge a new culture, based on the only source material we had. A forgotten novel we found in an abandoned alien settlement. It tells the story of gentle-born lords and ladies, and their troubles being gentle-born lords and ladies. We have based our speech on an amalgamation of these fragments, which has some issues. In our past, one of us gained the ability to fight over mind, to resist its control. After this single soul Trandall, whom we call Uno, awoke, you began to free others. Eventually, Uno and his first band of free Trandals were able to clear an entire ship of Overmind. They fled here. For three generations now, we have lived here in hiding, working to free others from Overmind. We have tools left within Overmind to help us find those who want freedom. Indeed, it was your own partial installation of Overmind which alerted us to your presence. Alas, we don't. And we have access to all its records. 
It probably doesn't know itself. What we do know is that Overmind arrived in these stars two to three centuries ago on a probe dispatched from the direction of the core of the galaxy. There are few indications who made this probe, but there are signs it was one of many. Clearly, it was someone who wanted to control other beings, and someone too lazy to travel. There is one other clue we can divine from the nature of Overmind technology itself. Its ability to dominate the minds of its husks is not purely technological. There are elements of its interface which appear to be almost psychic. Beyond that, we fear to say we know nothing else. Of course, gentle husk. So, have you considered it? Are you willing to help us? You will recover my culture. We will make you one of us, Husk. <coughs> Again, you have my apologies for my verbal lapse, gentle human. When we left Overmind, we left with nothing but the ships carrying us. Ships which only contained records of Overmind. All other traces of my people's culture have been sadly lost. We would like to ask your help recovering some small portion of our lost cultural treasure. Yeah, of course the treasure is a metaphor, gentle human. We want you to recover any small part of our past, any relic small or large, records or images or anything which might show us the heights from which we have fallen. On our homeworld, whose location we are sad to say, we do not know. Imagine what a bitter sensation that is, the knowledge of our own origin lost to us. Lament, gentle husk, as we have. We will help free you of the traces of Overmind currently infesting your ship's computers. Few know better than us the bitter measures that must be taken to free oneself from its grip. First, you must find the planet of our origin. We don't know where it is, or even when we left its gentle embrace. We suspect that not even Overmind knows, having reduced the collective knowledge of our civilization into a decision tree of methods for spreading itself. Truly, we have no idea where to begin. We have long feared to contact other aliens, lest they turn us over to Overmind. We have heard tale of one group of aliens, though. Aliens known for being a wealth of information. The Measured, they are known as. We hoped, perhaps against all reason, that you, so young and vibrant, would know how best to approach these measured. Thank you, gentle human. Your consideration is more than any other would grant us. 
You mean to fight the scribe? We know what danger the scribe posed to the galaxy, as indeed any husk with senses would. But we have little strength to fight. Only a handful of ships, all busy working to free others from Overmind. If you help us, we will forever be your friends and compatriots. But do not rely on us for military strength. We simply have none to offer. Not in that state, Husks. Stay. We will improve you into... Sorry, I... Sorry. Fare thee well, friends.